Cecilia Techno Militar Radio, saison 4, épisode 8. Nous sommes en compagnie de Anne Lizoshka. Hello. Hello Anne. So, can you tell me a bit about uh, yourself? Who are you? Uh, my name is Anna Mysochka. It's my uh, nickname, like DJ name, and uh, my real name as well. Uh, I'm from Ukraine. Uh, and uh, it's been uh, one year since uh, I'm in Marseille. Okay, cool. So, how did you end up like uh, listening and playing um, electronic music? Uh, I started um, 2019, I think. Yeah, it was um, a bar of my friends, and uh, they just uh, teach me how to play music, and uh, I really like this because before I was collecting a lot of music and a lot of um, playlists. I was sharing this with my friends. And for me, it was a really good opportunity to share music in a different way, not just playlist, but like start to play. And I'm here. <laughs> so cool. You are the kind of person that in a party people were asking you to play music. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> exactly. So cool. So now you're becoming a, um, a DJ. So when did you start to practice and... Uh, What kind of uh, influence, like uh, music influence, do you have? Oh, it was a uh, really like different stuff from uh, I don't know from my friends. We were like sharing a lot of uh, music, not only electronic music. We were like really into jazz and like um, old songs. Yeah, I can't say that like was influenced just the big from the beginning just electronic yeah but uh, from the beginning i used to play a lot of uh, afro house that was like really really something was touching me a lot of music with percussion with uh, tribal sound and with uh, folk vocals yeah i still try to even the my genre is like changing a lot i still trying to keep this vibe uh, in uh, my sets because i really like it and um, do you have uh, some events that really uh Um, reach you uh, during your um, construction as a DJ? No, it's like all all in one. I don't know. I, it's hard to pick up one, honestly. <laughs> okay, no worries. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you have a residency in uh, Lille Radio in Marseille. Can you tell us a bit about it? Yeah, um, I was uh, lucky to have the answer from uh, Lille Radio when I just arrived in Marseille. I was looking for a place where I can play uh, and especially I was collecting, I started to collect a lot of Ukrainian electronic music and uh, I just tagged them and they uh, quite fast answered me that they ready to have me for, the, uh, for a one-off. And then uh, with the start of a new season, uh, they asked me if I want to join them for like residency and to have the show. So <laughs> now I have the show, it's called uh, Made in UA and basically it's uh, all around uh, Ukrainian contemporary, contemporary electronic music. Amazing. So um, how do you stay connected with the scene? Uh, Can you tell a bit about the scene there? Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> huge. <laughs> uh, they still, uh, like a lot of people asking me, how is it now? Like compare the time uh, before war. I saying that uh, still uh, they doing parties, they doing uh, big raves, uh, just uh, it's during the day which uh, a bit uh, looks different and feels different but still uh, really nice and I'm really glad that people still like continue living and uh, um, yeah that's really important I think so the biggest festivals what we have uh, in Kiev like uh, Strichka, Schema, Veselka they um, still running up so yeah everything is good <laughs> Yeah, and a lot of producers start to make uh, a lot of music actually when war, like with the war, like during the war, because I think for a lot of musicians it's a way to um, mm, like kind of reflect the emotions and what is happening. So we have like a lot of art coming out now. Yeah, I guess it's a uh, um, important moment when you have to express things <laughs> differently uh, yeah find some uh, yeah and music it's a really powerful medium so yeah mm. we have a lot of stuff now 
And uh, do you think the artists there uh, still have their place to uh, express themselves, or it's hard for them to reach a scene and to live uh, with music right now? Yeah, it depends. Depends of the depends of the city. Depends of the situation of each artist. Because, yeah, in some places uh, we still have a quite like normal situation. Some places, some cities was like ruined completely. And uh, I know uh, people who was like escaping war from uh, south or east, and now they like trying to manage the, their life again. So for them, it's like of course complicated. Yeah. Okay, so what about Marseille? What do you think of the scene here, uh, the Marseille club scene and the electronic scene? Uh, what's your point of view about the scene? What did you experience? Um, that's um, I used to say like uh, Marseille feels like a big uh, big village or something because it's um, not that big. But the place is so nice. But like you can see a lot of people, and there's the same people kind of who are going out at the, on the parties. But uh, places is nice. Just uh, I think there is a lot of um, opportunities to growing up, like the night scene and the club scene. Yeah. And do you find your your place here? Do you feel welcome? Uh, <laughs> yes, it's my first and my main place. It's uh, Soma in uh, Kozhryan. Yeah, uh, it's bas it was my first place where I made the um, exhibition and the party. And now we're still in contact with uh, people there who like organize and the uh, owners of this place. It's like it's place in my heart <laughs> all the time, and I have some projects. Uh, I really glad to come there and to share the project and to do projects with them. Yeah, this is my place. <laughs> Big year for them. <laughs> and uh, what's your plan uh, for for the future uh, regarding your artistic project and yourself? Mm, now I'm I'm doing a course. Uh, I'm I'm learning how to produce music. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> so maybe in uh, some future I will uh, start to release something. Looking for for that, yeah. Really, really want to want to try. But I don't think I don't feel like I want to switch from DJing to producing. I really enjoy DJing. So yeah, it's like my my direction now. It's uh, more and more sets, more and more people, more and more stages, festivals, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we hope uh, for you. Uh, so can you tell us what you are going to play uh, to the radio? Yeah, today is going to be some UK-based tech, mm, um, get, a, get a tech. Yeah, really mm -hmm. fast, really mm -hmm. dancey. I will dance a lot as well. <laughs> yes, can't wait for that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Anne. Thank you too. <laughs>
Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake that booty, shake that booty, shake it, shake it, move it, move it, shake that booty, shake that booty, shake it, shake it, move it, move it, shake that booty, shake that booty, shake it, shake it, move it, move it, shake that booty, shake that booty, shake it, shake it, move it, move it, shake that booty, shake that booty. Take that booty, shake 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 that boo
Je te perds, je meurs.